So it'd probably be good if I pulled the bucket up. So what would be super awesome is if I knew where the light switch was. Can I just say this? I'm pretty sure this is like the worst part. It's um, covering the pit. Getting ready for day two. My boy did good yesterday. He was on this little tractor 10 hours, something like that. Eight, eight and you got eight done about eight to six. Cool. That's 10 hours. Ready to roll. They're, they're rolling, yeah. We do a lot of rolling around here. <laughs> rolling up things, rolling over things. <laughs> what do you think, Bonnie? I'm just happy to be here, Mommy. I can't, I can't, I'm holding my coffee. All right, we haven't gotten the first load today yet, but it'll be here shortly. He had to go get fuel. And this will be it. I'll take you in a little bit to the field the second field he's in, which he's a lot more happy with. And Junior, who's driving the other tractor, was just saying he could tell a difference. The last two loads yesterday came from the other, the river bottom field where the corn was better, and has not gotten so dry. And he said he could tell a huge difference in the moisture level. I don't know if you can hear me, so I'm gonna finish this in the truck. So what Junior was saying is that he could tell that the moisture level was a lot higher in this next field, which we knew it would be, which is a good thing. So he was explaining to me, when you're packing silage, you want higher moisture level because you can pack it better. If it's really dry, it's hard to pack down. So hopefully this, this today is gonna be better and the rest of the pit is gonna be easier to get packed down so we can get as much in there as we need and it will do what it needs to do to make amazing cow chow. Okie dokie. Day two, repeat from day one. Right, Bonnie? We go feed cows, I mean calves. And once again, my sweet husband filled up the buckets for me last night when he got off the tractor. I mean, yeah, he was on a tractor. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing. Come on, Bonnie. Good girl, you made it in one jump this morning. Feeling mighty spry. <gasps> don't sit on the seat, you might get it dirty. I know, that's silly, just kidding. Let's see how many times it takes to crank this morning. Two, three, four. <gasps> that's better. Oh, just kidding. Somebody's going to call me out on that. Come on, baby. There we go. Come on, Susie. Susie, Zuki, Sammy. She has so many names. Are you happy, girl? As a pig in poo. All right. Blow this joint. somebody's gonna judge me for that but I've been judged for a lot worse so anyway she's a blue healer Australian cattle dog with a little hitch in her giddy up because she's been hit a few times because she's a slow learner about getting out of the way and as you can tell she's very stoic she's basically the most awesome dog in the world right Bonnie
come on, boo, to the house. Check on Austin and go check on Hubs. Let's see what else we can get into today. You know, you really could walk to the house, but <sighs> since you're special and so sweet, I'll let you ride. There's the possibility of storms today. So after the dew dries, I'm thinking, oh, there's a little bunny. Did you see it? Hold on. Where it goes? I know y'all never seen a rabbit. There it goes. <laughs> I see you there, Peter. Um, I'm thinking that the grass might, mm, might need a mowing. Possibly with the bush hog or the hay cutter. Yeah. Day two lunch being cooked. Burger assembly line in action. We're rolling. Delivering lunch. And it is filling up, y'all. Good gracious. I didn't get to show you, but yesterday they had to add that board because there was a big hole. They had to wait for it to get high enough so they could get up to it. So. This is what it looks like. Everything's chopped up. Wish you could smell it. it. Smells good. I smelled it for you. These are beans. This part's a little sparse. Looking good over there. They're on the river. And y'all, I think we're gonna get some storms. They're calling for him. We'll see. He is way over there, waiting on him to get back. And then I'll ride with you. I'll ride with him through this field.
let some other puppies out that are probably about the bus. It's pretty though, isn't it, y'all? Okay, supper's a done deal. Me and my girl, she's so excited, are going to do the night shift. It's my turn to pack some silage, which I really don't mind doing. So, good job, Bonnie. Thank you, thank you. Just step, just step right on that. It's all good. <laughs> no, girl, I'm not leaving you. You get to go. <laughs> Here we are, and here we be. Uh, this is my husband's 4440. It's a little bit different than mine, but I think I can do it. Okay, so you can see, mine is a power shift. His is a quad range. I believe that's what that's called. So it's different. It's different than what I'm normal, what I'm used to. But I have my instructions to put it in A. One and reverse. We're going from A. We're going to stay in one A1 and A reverse. So, I should be able to do this, y'all. All right, let me find what I'm looking for. Also, it's thundering. It's thundering a lot. So, it might get rained out. We'll see. Oh, I remember what he said. You gotta push it a little to the right to get it to start. I couldn't show you. Oh, look. His has directions. He did this for the guy that's driving his tractor. Thermostat, fan. We're gonna turn the fan on. Get some AC. This one doesn't have a radio. Doesn't bother me, I never use it anyway. All right, here we go, boys and girls. A, one. You ready, Bonnie? All right. It'd probably be good if I pulled the bucket up. Yeah, that would be good. Please don't tell him I did that. Bonnie with me tonight because it is thundering and she would have been out there worrying herself to death following the tractor, so she's hanging out with mom. Y'all, this is all we're doing for I don't know how long. As long as I stay out here. <laughs> I figure at least an hour or so. Unless it gets, unless it starts raining. So what would be super awesome is if I knew where the light switch was. Uh, I thought it was the thing on the floor. But nothing's happening. I'm pretty sure it's not that yellow button. I'm not going to touch that. Ah, uh, this is the horn. Yeah, that works. This is the wipers. I don't need that. This is the turn signal. They work. But where are the lights? Also, it's lightning outside really bad. <sighs> Story of my life. Well, that was somewhat short-lived. There is a storm a-brewing. Um, I also cannot find the lights for the tractor. <laughs> oh, I am not too ashamed to say that. I was pushing a little button on the floor, but it wasn't working. So, I forgot to ask about lights. Okay? I will do better next time. <laughs> oh, oh, well. I got a little bit done. Calling it a... Oh. Yeah, she's lightning. We got... We got in the truck just in time. Worked out just right, Bonnie Blue. It's all right, girl. We're going home. It's raining sideways. Here we 
try again. Silage, day three. I got help this morning to get the feed in the buckets. He knows what to do. Got to turn the gas on. I got a gate getter this morning. Your corn came up in those beans. My boy has been packing all day, both days, so he hasn't gotten to ride with his dad and see what that process is like. So he's going with him now to do that. And I'm going to the house to catch up on some other things. Get burgers. <laughs> My son said he's not tired of them, so. Got some help today, some lunch help, handout help. <laughs> and the beat rolls on, something. <laughs> That's definitely filling up. Uh, full. <laughs> Looks full to me. push mower that I decided my girl decided my girl decided that she wanted to learn to push there's nowhere good to stand she wanted to learn to push with the push mower so I started it for I hadn't been started in like eight years started right up with some fresh gas she pushed it five feet and decided that's actually not what she wanted to do so I decided I would use it and do some trim work because typically I only trim with Roundup. Great, it worked great. I, I got very hot, very sweaty, very tired, but I did it. It's um, it's rigged up a little bit somehow, some way to get it to cut off and I can't remember how to do that. So I couldn't get it to cut off. So it sat here and ran for 20 minutes while I went inside and changed and collected myself. And I came out and I had a very bright idea. I ran it in this tall grass. This is a septic system area. It basically never gets mowed. Um, and I choked it off and that worked. So now I'm gonna take topless over here and we're gonna finish the job. Excuse this. A 
tree attacked me when I was mowing. Um, the really fun part, I guess will come tomorrow when we get to take all this plastic and unravel it and put it on the pit and cover it with tires. They're having fun. <laughs> hmm. So I don't know if I have explained this very well. Actually, I don't know if I've explained it at all. I'm sorry. So he is packing the silage down and the best way I can explain this that I understand it is you want to get as much or all of the oxygen out of there as possible so that it does not grow bacteria. Then after we cover it, it ensiles, it ferments, and it doesn't spoil. You want to get as much oxygen out as possible to keep it from spoiling. And then when we start to feed it in the winter, we uncover it just a little bit at a time and feed off the end. And once we start feeding it, we don't stop feeding it. Um, you gotta keep feeding it or it'll spoil where it's been exposed to air. So that's, that's what's happening there. It's a very important process or part of the process is packing it down. So the more it can be packed, the better. The tighter it is, the better. Everybody in? Bonnie, present. Clara, present. Gus, present. Austin. Special present. Special present, yeah. Four silage which is almost over today it's gonna be over let's we'll see can we get cranking <gasps> wow Whoop. Oh, it was short-lived come on baby you can do it you can do it run to the local our local co-op where we are going to get a silage cover because that is going to be today's amazingly awesome fun job right kids mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> um, sorry Bonnie you can't ride up there you gotta get down I'm like, sorry, Austin. Yeah, mommy I fit I fit just fine no you don't <laughs> you're such a little diva Okay, here we go. Getting ready to go. Ow. Getting buyers, that's what we're doing. Cover it. Cover it up. That deserves a water. I'm gonna sit on the cooler. A little red, a little sweaty. How much did you do? I... <laughs> it's fine. Your day's coming when you get a little bigger. Brother, brother helped tremendously. There he is. What was more fun, packing or? covering. 
Lunch. He said lunch. Lunch was the most fun. Did you enjoy your lunches? Good. Watching the truck come in because you're one load closer to the end. Watching the truck come in less you're one load closer to the end. Watching the truck come in every time, knowing you're one load closer to the end. No. Oh, you did good. I'm really proud of you. You hung in there. Three solid days on the tractor all day, like a real farmer. I'm just glad it wasn't four solid days. Today is day four. Okay. Yeah. Day four <laughs> anyway, he's a good kid. Does it feel good? I'm putting you on camera. Does it feel good to have that done? Yeah. How do you feel about it? Good. Because it's done or because it's good silage? Both? Well, 65 loads is good silage. 65 loads. Uh, what did you tell me it was per acre? I done out. The 65 loads in that 18 acre field turned out 20, 23 tons to the acre. 23 tons to the acre. All right. That ought to feed some cows and calves for a little while. And next is picking, possibly, or just combining, or both. I don't know. Okay. We gotta wait and see what the if the storm coming in, man. Junior gonna have to go to picking corn. <laughs> we we're, we're gonna move the stuff out of the big part of the barn this time. Put it over there. Put it over there in the big part where we can. Yeah, I'm ready. You need more room. You did last year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not caught in your hand. What's in my hand? Oh my what? The bottle. Saw, the bottle got popped in. Please, please, please. Turn, turn, turn on your. Turn on your. Don't take much to use, y'all. Deb, you'll wash the cut in the dump That's bag. That's how my the, kids uh, train me. I clean the tractor. Yeah, I'm just. Uh, maybe did I just say this? I'm pretty sure this is like the worst part. Is um covering the pit, but. Once it's done, it's done, and, and we're done, part. and then that's the best part. <laughs> it just gets to sit and ferment and wait on fall <laughs> to start being used. <sighs> that's about a wrap for silage, y'all. It's been a fun, full, fun, Wesley doesn't agree that it was fun, a fun, full four days. <laughs> Stay tuned. Thanks for being here. Signing off. For now. Peace. For now. <laughs>